Praise the Lord, saints. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Welcome to another day. A day of another day of daily prayer. This is the day that the Lord has made. Can somebody say that with me? This is the day the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah. Glory. My brothers and sisters, this is the day where you can give God praise and honor and glory because you have another day. You have breath in your body to do so. God has given you, gifted you this day so that you can praise Him. No matter what the circumstances, God is a good God. Hallelujah. That's who he is. He's a good God. He's a good father for those that are in Christ Jesus, his only begotten son. Do you hear that? For those who are in Christ Jesus, his only begotten son. Amen. And I want you to open up your Bibles today and turn over to John 15. John 15, starting at verse 7. Hallelujah. And while you're doing that, I want to talk to those who are just hanging out. You're just cruising the internet and you stumbled upon this broadcast, but you don't know Jesus, but you're curious. Then I want you to continue to stay with us in the name of Jesus. At the end of this program, we're going to introduce you to Jesus, the he is the king of kings. Yes, he is. He is everything. Hallelujah. The only begotten son, the God man. Hallelujah. Fully God, fully man who came down and walked the face of this earth. I want to introduce you to him. If you do not know Jesus as your Lord and Savior. And uh, you just keep coming and checking out these broadcasts. and uh, But you hang out with us to the end of the broadcast. And then we're going to walk you through prayer and introduce you to Jesus. Okay, starting in verse 7 in John 15. It says here, if you abide in me and my words abide in you, you shall ask what you will and it shall be done unto you. Okay, hold on. We want to just, we want to read verse 8, 9, and 10, but we want to stop here at verse 7. You know, you see that equation, 1 plus 1 equals 2? Huh. 1, if you abide in me, 2, my words abide in you, equals, you shall ask what you will, and it shall be done unto you. Amen. Look, abiding in Jesus, he says, if you abide in me, that means you are born again. That means that you have a new life. Amen. That old man does not exist anymore. Oh, yeah, you may fight some of the, you know, the things that that try to creep up. But let me tell you something. You are getting faith from glory to glory. You're getting victory each and every day as you abide in Jesus. Amen. That is your born again that is your that is that born again experience this the new life that you now have after you confessed and received Jesus in your heart amen amen and you continue therein amen you continue therein working out your own salvation with fear and trembling. You continue in the faith of Jesus Christ. Amen. Continuing in the faith that was once delivered to the saints. You are the saint of God now that you've received Jesus. So you abide in him. Abide in him. And his words. His words. 
abide in you. What is his words? The word of God. Jesus is the word. So you're talking about this Bible. He says, if you abide in me, my words abide in you. You shall ask what you will and it shall be done unto you. It is as simple as that. That's right. Jesus made it absolutely plain as as vanilla. He made it plain as day. Now the question is, are you abiding? Are you in Jesus? Amen. You're living in him. You're you're living in the faith. You're not in Jesus, but you live like hell. You live like the devil. Come on now. Come on. I'm just going to be real. All right. You're not living in the, you're not, you're in Jesus. You, you confess Jesus, but you're still, you're still in, you're still sleeping around. Come on. Come on. Let's talk about it. You still, uh, uh, yeah, you're still uh, doing the things that you were doing before you received Jesus. No change. That is almost called a backslidden life. Come on, let's just be real about it. You're still snorting at crack cocaine. You're still fornicating. Or you're living an alternative lifestyle. Come on. Come on. And they've got all kinds now under the under the under the chart. Come on. Come on. You can't you can't say that you are abiding in Jesus when you live like you live like the devil. Come on, let's let's just keep it real. And his words abide in you, the word of God. You've got to know this word. You've got to know the word of God, saints. You got to know what God has promised to those that believe on Jesus. Because when you pray, you got to you got to know what God has made available to you. He said you can ask what you will and it will be done to you. It will be done be done unto you. So you got to know what to ask for. So your so his words have to abide in you. And God has he's given us all things pertaining to life and godliness. So there's nothing that God has left his children without. Right? There's no there's nothing that God is keeping from you. There's no as a matter of fact, God gives us above and beyond what we ask or think amen you can't some some of us can't even think on the magnitude of the blessings that God has and wants to give to you but you what you've got to know the word and why is this he says herein is my father in verse 8 my father glorified that you bear much fruit so yet so shall you be my disciples we are We are the disciples of Jesus Christ, right? We follow Jesus, not another man, not another woman. You follow Jesus. Amen. And as the father has loved me, so have I loved you. Continue ye in my love. Now this is okay. Maybe we can pick this up on another passage here because this is a big deal it says here as the father has loved me so have I loved you God loves Jesus loves us the father loves Jesus and Jesus loves us and it says continue in my love oh my goodness you mean you mean it just doesn't you mean you have to continue in the love of God in the love of Jesus yes don't fall out of love with him As the Father has loved me, so have I loved you. Continue in my love. That means you cannot continue in his love. Is that right? 
The opposite of continue is to not continue. That means that you must love Jesus every day. It's a relationship. That's why we are not a religion. We, we have a relationship. Continue in my love. That denotes a relationship. That means a real relationship. Like you have with your children. Or you have with your spouse. Or you have with your, your friends. You have a relationship with Jesus. It just doesn't end when the pastor closes the Bible. Amen. Glory to God. I'm just here to tell you the truth today. There is a relationship that Jesus is looking for with you. He loves you. And verse 10, if you keep my commandments, you shall abide in my love. Even as I have kept my father's commandments and abide in his love. All right, saints, we're going to go ahead and pray. This is a little continued uh, extended Bible study, but let's move into prayer right now. Come on, come on, come on, let's pray. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Come on, saints. Come on. Come on. Press in. Holy Spirit. Yay. Thank you. Come on, saints. Come on. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Ramoko hoshiti namaha Ropoto ramoko hoshiti arabata ramoho Ropoto ramoko hoshiti arabata ramoho Ropoto ramoko ho Ropoto ramoko ho Yetene maharabata namaha Come on saints come on press in press in Speak to Jesus speak to the Lord speak to the Lord Ropoko hoshiti namaha Remetine moho rabaka ha Roboto ramoko hoshiti rabata Roboto ramoko hoshiti ramata ramoho Remete namoho Rabako hoshiti Romoto ramoko ho Rabata namoho rabati rabata raboko ho Romoto ramoko hoshiti rabata ramoho Roboto ramoko hoshiti ramata namaha Roboto ramoho Roboto ramoko ho Shete remehe Ramata ramoko ho Yeramata ramaho Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yera botona moko. Come on, saints. Come on. Robotona moko hoshiti era matara moho. Robotona moko hoshiti era batara boho. Robotona moho. Yere meti ne moho. Rabatana maharabaka ha. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yete ne moho rabate yera maha. Robotona moho ramati yera matara moko ho. Robotona moho rabati yera matara moko ho. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Roboto ramo ho rabati rabata ramo ko ho ramati ramo ha. Rabata ramo ho rabata ramo ko ho. Repete ramo ho rabati rabata ramo ho. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Roboto ramo ho rabata rabo ho. Roboto ramo ko ho repe rabata ramo ho. Roboto ramo ho rabaka ha. Ramoti rabata ramo ho. Rona rabaka ha. Yeti ramo ho rabaka ha. Roboto ramo ko ho. Yera botara moho rabaka ha yera botara moho Roboto no moho rabati yera matara moho Jesus Jesus Roboko ho ramati yera maha Ramatara moko ho thank you father Roboto no moko ho rabati yera botara moho Roboto no moko ho thank you father Roboko ho shiti yera maha Roboto no moko ho Roboto no moho Thank you, Jesus. Roboko ho rabati yena motara moho rabata raboko ho. 
Rabotana Mokoho, Rabete Yaramatana Moho, Jesus, Rebetini Maharabakaha, Rabotana Moho, Raboko Hoshi Yarabatana Moho, Rabati Yaramaha, Ramatana Moko, Rabe Yaramatana Moho, Rabatana Moko Hoshi Yarabatana Moho, Rabatana Moko Hoshi Yarabatana Moho, Rabatana Moko Hoshi Tinamaha, Rabatana Moko Hoshi Yarabatana Moho, Rabatana Moko Ho, Rabatana Moho, Ramati Yarabatana Bakaha, Rabatana Moho, Rabatana Rabaka Hashiri and Maharabatara Moho, Rapatara Boko Hoshiti Rabatara Boho. Holy, 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 Rabakaha. Father, thank you so much for your goodness and mercy. For your goodness and mercy. Roboko Horamati Rabaha, Roboko Hoshiti Rabaha. Father, I ask that you touch each and every person under the sound of my voice. I perceive today that there is a, a rabbi. Listening to this broadcast in the name of Jesus, thank you, Lord. I just want you to know that God absolutely loves you. And Jesus Christ is Lord. Hallelujah. And he has a plan for your life. He has a plan for your life. Hallelujah. Oh, Rabakaha. Father, I ask that you fill each and every person under the sound of my voice with the fire of God today in the name of Jesus. I ask you, Father, for your shield of protection to be around each and every person today in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Lord, in the name of Jesus, I ask that you would uproot every evil weed of the devil out of the lives and the hearts of the people in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. I ask that you uproot every lie in the name of Jesus out of their hearts today in the name of Jesus. And Father, let the seeds of righteousness, the word of God, be written in their hearts today. Hallelujah. Robokoho. Holy Spirit, I ask you for fresh oil to be poured out. Let your spirit, Holy Spirit, be poured out today upon your people today. Hallelujah. 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 Roboko horemeti rabaharabataraboho. Rebete ne moko hoshiti ramaha. Ramako hayerabotaramaho. And I ask you, Jesus, that you would set them free from the captivity that the devil has held them in today. In Jesus' name, I thank you, Jesus. Let your name be lifted up and upon their lips in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus, that you are the baptizer in the fire in the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. I ask that you would baptize today, Lord, in the fire of God today, Father. Hallelujah. 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 Jesus Christ, I give you the glory. Ah, Rabaka Hayaraboto, Ramaka Yarabotaramaho, Remete Ramako Hayarabotaramaho Rabaha, Remaka Hayaraboto Ramoho, Ramoko Hoshetemehe, Remete Remokoho, Remete Rebekehe, Ete Remoho Rabakaha, O Rabaka, let the fire of God be released in their lives. Baptize them today, Father, in Jesus' name thank you lord thank you lord hallelujah amen saints amen and if you are joining us today and you don't know jesus then i want to lead you into prayer i want you to repeat after me say dear god i come to you as a sinner and i want to receive jesus as my lord i ask you to forgive to forgive me for all my sins. I confess with my mouth and believe within my heart that Jesus Christ is Lord. Glory to God. Glory to God. Amen. Amen. The angels in heaven are rejoicing over you right now. And now I want to pray, Father. I ask that you would baptize each and every person that's just received you in, with the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. Lord, I ask that you would baptize them in the fire of God.
And I ask you, Holy Spirit, with the evidence of speaking in tongues, thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father, for your might and your power and your glory. I give you praise for your beloved children today. In Jesus' name, amen, amen. All right, my brothers and sisters, I want to thank you for joining me today. And if you just received Jesus Christ as Lord, you can send me an email at house prayer for all. That is house prayer and that's the number for all and just let at gmail.com and just let me know you've received Jesus and I want to correspond back with you okay well my beloved brothers and sisters and friends if I just look forward to seeing you again on another day of daily prayer. You have a wonderful day in Jesus' name. Okay, bye-bye.